a building on government street that i thought i was gonna get and it, well it didn't turn out that way um but it was nice it was small and it was just the right size for what i was looking for but it didn't happen so let's move on to the next thing here's me before i get on my flight to orlando to go look at food trucks and trailers i was going to get one built out but the cost was between 30 to 35 thousand dollars that was the quote I kept getting, so I was like, okay, I'm not about to pay for that. So I got a drink and flew back to Baton Rouge. And here I'm at this Trailer World place. I seen a price for the trailer that I wanted online, but when I got here, the man that's driving me around, he gave me a whole nother price. So he was trying to jip me, and I was like, um, I think I'm going to go and try to find a used trailer. And that's exactly what I decided to do. I found a used trailer on Facebook Marketplace and my mom's friend took me to go get it and he drives extremely slow so it took all day. Then the next day. It's not even that big. It's not. I have a hole in my floor of my trailer and um, I didn't see it when I was going to purchase it. It's a used trailer. I found it on Facebook Marketplace. And um, I didn't see it. And my second pair of eyes that came with me, they seen it and they didn't tell me. And yeah, I'm a little upset about that because I could have negotiated the price down a little bit more. But anyways, we're gonna talk about that. So I'm gonna try to repair this with a piece of plywood. I watched a few DIY videos on YouTube. So hopefully this go right. I'm gonna see if I could do it. If I can't, I'm gonna take it to somebody and get them to fix it. But at least I wanna try it first, so. So I didn't repair it myself. I hired somebody and I didn't show it, sorry. So here you see me at an uh, auction with my brother and we didn't do anything. Where are you All right. I am looking for a truck to pull my trailer. So, look where I'm at. I am at the auction lot. So, I'm gonna try this one out first. like that one so now we're gonna go and see C21 let me show you how it look on the outside this is C21 it is very dirty on the inside I think this is the one that's dirty yeah it's dirty oh lord look at all that and it's missing like a whole panel or something okay anyways has to almost 300,000 miles. Okay. Oh, that's the AC. That's what that is. Let's see, does the heat work? Now we're gonna do C12. Let's do C12. I think this was the one that I was looking at. Was it? No, it's not. Oh, that's scary looking at the top. Ugh. Oh, yikes. I'm not even going to get in this, so I'm just going to kind of find my way. And it doesn't start. Let's see. Don't start. Okay, this key can come out. 
Let's do this again for the last time. C13, I'm gonna show you. It has a boat attached to it, so I don't know if the boat comes with it. Oh no, it's not attached. Okay, I'm tripping. Anyways, let's go. I'm gonna wear my rain boots because it's raining and it's cold. So this is the last one I'm gonna check on. All right, it's a 2006 Chevrolet. And it's really nice on the inside. It's actually pretty clean. Look at this. No panels missing. The AC not just a big hole. Okay. Let's start it up. It doesn't start? Oh, that is such a bummer. Maybe it probably, you probably have to jump start it. But it's so clean. All the dirty ones start on their own. How many miles does it have? It doesn't say. Okay, I'm gonna have to go look this one up on the website. <sighs> the business starts tomorrow. So I probably won't post this till Sunday because I don't want y'all bidding me, outbidding me. So hopefully. I get a truck because I was at an auction in Livingston yesterday and I did not get a truck. All of them were, um, I was outbidding like about four or $5,000. So. so I'm bidding okay. on this and I don't know if I was the last one to bid. It says closing in pro progress, but I haven't received the email yet. So my hands are shaking. <laughs> I don't know if I won. It's on.